It's Anel, and we're here with Ardell Lashes, and there's one of the makeup artists is putting on um, an eyelash on uh, this lady right here. Hi, I'm Susie, and I'm putting on the Ardell Lashes. This is the Claudia. It's a runway uh, runway style, which is a little bit longer, but it's still natural and still pretty. It's going to just add a little bit of length there and give a nice little lift at the end. So when I start, I'm going to take it out of the box. And what I have to do first is measure it. So basically, you want it to start where your lashes start and end where your lashes end. Any excess, you're going to just go ahead and cut that off. You never want to cut the lashes this way, only at the end of the band. So open and look down. And actually, it fits her eyes perfectly. There's no excess, so I'm not going to have to cut any off. So now next step is, I'm using the Duo Adhesive. I love the Duo because it's a surgical adhesive. It's latex based, so you want to make sure that they're not latex allergic. Are you allergic to latex? So then she's okay. And I like it because it's a little bit more resist water resistant than any of the other adhesives out there. And what you're going to do is you're just going to take a little bit and just basically do a very thin layer right directly on the band. A lot of people make the mis first mistake by overdoing it. And that's where it gets really messy, it gets all over your lashes, and it takes forever to dry. So you just want an even amount and just coat the whole band. And then I wait for it to get a little bit sticky. If I apply right now, it's not tacky yet, so it just slides. And when you blink, it naturally pushes up the lash. So if I wait for it to get sticky, I'll kind of hold there. So how long do you normally wait? Like, you can tell, like, it's a thin layer, so it's probably about 15 seconds. Okay. You can tell this is gray. It starts turning black as it dries. Okay. So you're going to target right on the lid above their own lashes, but as close as you can so you don't see a gap between okay. your lashes and the fake lash. So I just go ahead and get it right there. I usually center it and then kind of push the ends in. And you do this after all your makeup. If you it's want so fast. <laughs> I know it's it's so it's just that easy. I think a lot of people get intimidated by these fake lashes, but they're really easy and it's so much faster than curling your lashes and getting all the mascara on if you want fullness and length. And you can already see like what it's done. It just adds a nice lift right here. I mean, she already has amazing lashes on her own, but we always want more. We're never satisfied. So, it's like, same thing again, just a thin layer, wait for it to get really tacky, I'm going to zone for right there, if you have eyeliner on, it helps give you a little bit more of a target zone on where to apply, and a little bit more room for mistakes, too, if you get it up a little too high. Just make sure you're always pushing it in, because when we blink, it naturally lifts off. So how long do you want to wait before you can actually blink again? <laughs> well, you, no, you can blink. You just have to keep making sure you're pushing it into your lid. Okay. So it dries on your lid and not off. If it's off and the band has dried, then you just have to add a little bit more adhesive and then hold it right on the lid. Thank you for showing us how you apply the eyelashes, and I hope we see you around. See you around makeup talk. Okay, thank you.